Hello there. I'm CJ with MI Gaming, back in Starfield with CJ Kenobi here. And again, once again, we are back at the Lodge of the Constellation Headquarters. Vasco, who will permanently rust in his corner. On the last part, we were able to collect Artifact Chai, Chi, Artifact Chi Chi, and put it in there with the other beta and I uh, maybe the first one was alpha can't recall but we have found another one thanks to the lovely help of our cowboy friend something. over here Sam Co and we kind of did a little bit of family bonding with his father and his uh, daughter so we helped them out in more ways than one unfortunately that did mean Sarah over there was kind of twiddling her thumbs but I think I will take her back on the journey and we will do whatever next is up for Constellation. So we will do a little shopping before we head off. And I think she wants to do Barrett. I, I don't agree. I think we'll see that Russian guy. I think he was Russian. Whoever he was. Vladimir. Who was he? Hey. Yes. What's the I and who's Vladimir? We maintain a star station in orbit above us. It's where we do all our deep space scanning. Vladimir runs the station. Brilliant astronomer. Years of practical experience. Oh, sounds like you're quite fond of him. Well, are you ready to head back out? I'm right behind you. Okay, well, I'd rather prefer you at my side, but okay. Do you want me? You know, I am a melee character, so I understand. I did increase rank oh, up my health. Adventure. So hopefully that means we can do a few more stabby stabs before things go south. All right, Vasco, hold the fort down. We're gonna go do some shopping. I am at your service, Captain. Not anymore, you are. Clothiers? Oh my goodness. Maybe they. Maybe you all will have an official Jedi outfit. Let's take a look. No, that's very Sam Co. Father. No, not not quite Jedi. Ah, uh, that's more Imperial. I'd like to speak to you. Sure, Sarah, but um, can we do it after I accessorize? No. Please let me know if I may assist you. Yes, please something better than what you have on the floor. You won't find a larger array of options in all the settled systems, I guarantee you. Really, I see two to three options at best. Sir. I. I'll see you again. I'm sure. so disappointed in these offers. Literally, my poncho was the best Jedi theme. At another competitor, mind you. All right, Sarah, now that I'm in a bad mood, let's talk. Thanks for taking the time to talk. I wanted to ask you about the artifact you found on Vectera. When you pulled it from the rock, held it in your hands for the first time, how did you feel? Oh. How does one feel when they hold the universe in their hand? Definitely visions, sounds, music, Commander Shepard, Reapers, Protheans. It's all so vivid. Yeah. No, no, I, I don't think you understand. I know about the visions, the light, and the music. How did you feel inside? What were your thoughts? No. Yes, that sounds close, but careful, that's dangerously Sith-like. Okay. No, I do remember. No. Yes. No. Oh, resist the Sith. Oh my goodness. That must have been terrifying. When it comes to the artifacts, it never ceases to amaze me how the science, well, simply fails. Ah, uh, you know, can't science just be the how and not the why? Hmm. 
I'm sure there's a rational explanation. If there is, the artifacts are doing a heck of a job hiding it. The artifacts are so different, so alien. And I'm certain one of them reached out and spoke to you. Quite the mystery. Well, it probably did, and you know, language is hard, especially alien language. I'm sure there's some clicks and clacks and weird bug-like sounds. Hmm. Agreed. Unfortunately, there's no way that I know of to reply. And believe me, I've been trying to gather data on the damn things for years. Yeah, what have you gathered? Not much, I'm afraid. All I have to show for my efforts are eyewitness accounts, scores of inconclusive metallurgical test results, and wild theories. I like wild theories. Frustrating? No. <laughs> Bewildering? Yes. It would be... Oh, well, an explorer's dream to solve a mystery like this. Well, careful, you know, sometimes you get to the bottom of a, the mystery and it's um, not quite what you're expecting. <laughs> think, of, think, think of the fame, the power. No, that's Seth. I knew I picked the right person for the job. Look, I wanted to thank you for taking the time to talk and for keeping an open mind. And I also wanted to say, well, I'm pleased we're on this journey together. <laughs> it's the best decision I've made in quite a long time. Okay. Well, Sarah, you are the only female companion I've really stumbled across, so... And you're walking backwards. So I'm not sold that you are my soulmate, even if the game's trying to push you on me. But by default, right now you are my soulmate. What are you looking at, Mr. I don't have any Jedi clothes? Discrimination at its finest. Open 49 hours, I see. This planet's got... Ooh. Slightly over two-day cycle... Ooh, I bet insomnia is crazy around here. CJ's, whoa! I didn't know I had a place. CJ's, that's what your store said? <laughs> oh, Morgan, help yourself to anything around here, okay, Sarah? It's all on the house. It's my place, after all. What brings you in? Curtis Julian. How did you know my real name? Need something but don't have a lot of time? That's why I'm here. Yeah, how's business at CJ's? Nice and steady. Just the way I like it. Me too. I've got a good location, plenty of foot traffic, and a ton of people who are in a hurry and need to make a quick stop for the essentials. If things keep going this way, I'm going to start opening franchises all over the settled systems. Now, calm down. We like our mom and pop shop feel you know we don't want to spread out everywhere and then you know it loses that special exclusive exclusiveness okay it, it loses something be seeing you well that didn't have jack shit either we're not getting the gist of this game yet or people just don't have what i need hey i think we should meet up at chunks later Ooh, Centaurian Arsenal. Yes, please. Oh, although we are not. Whoa, Sanitation Minibot, excuse me. All right, we are not a gun. But I see some actual melee options. Hell yeah, brother. You want to do some business? I'm sure you already know there's no one-size-fits-all solution for personal firearms. Exactly. And the only arms I fire are lefty and righty here. Talk to Welcome me. Welcome to Centurion Arsenal. It is my absolute pleasure to assist you with any purchases or questions you may have. All sales are final, but that won't matter because you will undoubtedly be pleased with your purchase. You have my word. Perfect. 
Okay, let's uh, take a look. Please, take a look. Oh, this is a nightmare. She didn't have a single melee besides an axe and a knife. What? What do you call that right there? That is my newest weapon. This is terrible. All right, I am bound and determined to only use Jedi weaponry or weaponry that resembles Jedi. Oh. <sighs> One day we'll have a lightsaber. Maybe I need to figure out how to create it. What the hell's chunks? <laughs> Welcome to chunks. Mongolian beef with a little bit of red cheesecake, sure. Welcome to chunks. Thanks for choosing chunks. Which chunks would you like today? Yeah, what what is this like? Soylent green? Chunks are the highest quality ingredients sourced from all over the settled systems, and uh, I forget the rest. Well, that's okay. This is probably your side job, isn't it? You know, still in high school. I'm happy to serve you. Sure you are. All right, thanks for the Mongolian beef. What's in here? Is this a bar, a little nightlife? La la. Well, Sarah, you mind if uh, we sit and chat some more? Hey, stay over here. Excuse me. A drink, please? Huh? I do hope you are enjoying your time in New Atlantis. No, no, don't let them know we're poor. I'd like to see a menu. My pleasure. Oh, thank you Enjoy so much. The rest of your day. About a few Solomon reserves for that damage resistance. I think that'll come in handy. A little attacking my enemies while having a nice buzz. Best drinks in town, hands down. Oh yeah, I agree. Ah, uh, look at this. Isn't this nice, Sarah? not doing the main quest and just kind of having a little little date night shopping drinks you telling me your life story about constellation almost makes a man want to get down on one knee and propose almost time to get this ship moving did you say get this ship moving or this ship moving because i agree with both Okay, let's board. Haven't set foot on the eye for ages. Hope Vladimir is in a good mood today. Oh, well. Why, did you two uh, have a history? Do some dating? Something I should be uh, aware of? Now that we're kind of semi-engaged? Ah, is this the man? How you doing? We got a rook on deck. Good to see Constellation getting some fresh blood. <laughs> I'm no rook. I was a space miner. Sure, good to meet Glad you. Glad you two finally have a chance to meet. Wish I could have been down at the lodge to see the artifacts come together. But I got a little lost peeking through the eye. Sure. Always preferred working alone, even around people I like. But we're all working together on this one. No finer group in the stars to be unraveling this mystery. Now, this station, the Eye, rigged up for deep space scans. Barrett and Sarah teased out the signs of where our artifacts could be hiding after we caught our second one. But the data takes a slow ride along the Sea of Light years or decades between us and the fringes of space without a grav drive. I see, and this is where old CJ Kenobi comes in, huh? 
All right. You won't be the only constellation out there. Andresia and Matteo are both following up on scans themselves. Matteo went out recently, but Andresia... It's been a while. Hate to pull the worried old man act on you, but... I'm an old man, and... I'm worried. All right, say no more, fam. I'll keep an eye out. Yes, indeed. Stop worrying so much, Vladimir. If she's out there, we'll find her. She should be at one of the two sites I've marked on your star map. Can take care of herself, but we all need backup sometimes. Anyway, hopefully you'll be catching Fortune's smile, and we'll have some more artifacts to take a closer look at. Happy hunting. So far, we have a pretty good track record of going off on an exploration and coming back with an artifact. That's a pleasant change of scenery. I mean, it really was more of the same, but sure. Settle in. We'll head off to investigate that other person. Make sure you're strapped in. Procyon 3 on a damaged hull. We are off in 3, 2, 1. Oh, shit. I landed on A. Oh, here we go. <laughs> hey, contact Charlie 3. That's you. Charlie 3. I got some information for you. Uh, please uh, acknowledge. I got some important to say. Save your life. Is this, is this you? All right. Nice to meet you. Bye, Charlie Three. Hi. Just doing my daily paying it forward. Avoid the Altair system. Back big time. All right, thanks for the warning. Sure. So, I'm doing my rounds, uh, pick up supply drops, and I grab into the Altair system, and oh, boy, spacers all over the damn place there. Distress call, yammering nonstop. Something big's going down there, and all of us with no skin in the game, this we just give it a wide berth. <laughs> Am I right? Man, you are right on the nose. No. <laughs> well, I skid that as soon as my grab drive can spin up. But, uh, yeah. Lucky. Bye, Charlie 3. You've been like the best Charlie 3 I've talked to all week. Sure. the atmosphere here. I guess we can exit. Oh, I never tire of visiting worlds like this. Whoop, maybe not. There we go. Extreme cold. Hmm. Did not get that impression. Anybody home? Ah, uh, somebody's home. And they don't want me here. And they died standing up. <laughs> uh, good for you. In frosty temperatures like this, there's nothing better than a flask of a good English whiskey to keep you warm. Sure, I'll take the whiskey, but maybe of the Tennessee variety. A turret, huh? Oh no, and it's hard hitting. Let's just um run inside. Protective region. Oh, whoa! Where'd you come from, people?
Okay. That got tricky real fast. Keep at him. Oh, no. Two more, huh? Three more. All right, let's get in there. Hit this guy. Shit. Let's put that explosion. Okay. Let's come in. Put this guy now. Get this guy. Another Woo! Tough cookies. Well, well, well. More. More pirates for the slaughter. Come on, let's hone in on one of them. Oh boy. Hello, hello, don't mind me. Hey, I said don't mind me. Oh, so you're a melee person too, huh? Everybody coming up for the slaughter, huh? Whoa! Not cool, guys. Okay, is anybody in here? Oh, yes. Excuse me. No, no, stop that. You guys are ornery. All of you. Criminal activity in this area will be punished. And severely, I hope. No, 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 they're downstairs. Ah, you're worthless. Sarah. Why are you napping on the job, Sarah? What is this? Fine. Oh. There's one. Just the one left? Maybe, yeah. No, 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 you didn't hear anything. Oh, there's two. Three. Oh, this is bad. No, take him out. Wait, what was that? Yeah, right here. Are they not going to come in here? Sarah, please get up. I need you. Oh, there they are. Come on, in here. Come on. Just around the corner. Sarah, please. Now is not the time for your shenanigans. Come on. The enemy may be attempting to evade my sensors. All the way in. A search pad. I am there you go. Take him down, security robot. Oh, yeah, that's some good work. Not quite down, though. There you are. I will use this chance to kill them. That's one down. Two more, two more, two more. Ooh, he's strong. Come on, kill him. Help me out with this one, he's tough.
No, you can't run away from this. Now you're cornered. Pirate rover. A couple more and you're done. Maybe not. Try this. Yeah, screw you, buddy. Ooh, you got something rare. Legendary, huh? Good work distracting them. Let's get them. No, 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 you don't. I've killed everyone else. It's your turn. Well, I'll be. This legendary outfit is quite nice. I'll take it. See if it uh, handles combat a little better. If nothing else, it's legendary, right? Oh. You gave your life for the cause. Thank you. Sarah, quit napping on the job. Okay. Is this how you're going to be for the rest of this mission? Fine. Stubborn as always. <laughs> so this is where they piled in all the bodies. See if they've got any weapons or Whoa! Who said that? <laughs> Was that the... <laughs> is she now a spirit? Let's see what they were digging. Well, well, well. Already an artifact, huh? Well, that was fast. Which one are you? Zeta. Well, we skipped quite a few. Use a weapon. All right. Well, I took one of their weapons, so let's see how this fares. Oh, yeah. What is it? It's just more of the same. Uh, this is very disappointing. I do like how they all float, though. That is fun. Well, let's get out of here and report the good news. All right, we got the artifact, Sarah. I'll meet you on the ship. Sarah! She decided not to join us still. Well, maybe she'll decide to join us at the lodge. Second thought, Sarah can join me to Nira. Bounty hunter. Um, let's just ignore. Whoa, buddy. We're not in to fighting, okay? Alright, never mind. We are going to pay this bounty. Yes.
Yes. This is not the bounty you are looking for, my friend. Here's 2,000 credits and be on your way. I'm a bottomless pit, let's be honest. But thanks for the warning. Let's go land on that damn planet. Hmm, more enemies. Why are they always at our dig sites, huh? This is getting ridiculous, Sarah. Oh, and it's good to see you on your own two feet, Sarah. Reinforcements, too. Well, let's just head on in. Well, well, well. Who are you? Don't come any closer. Identify yourself. <laughs> oh, we found you. Constellation, Vladimir sent me to find you. Ah, oh, good. I suppose I should have guessed. It has been too long since I checked in. I'm just glad we found you unharmed, Andresia. Vladimir and I were worried. You are the newest member, yes? Do they often send you to check up on other, more senior members? No, just this one time. Perhaps. I suspect Vladimir worried you might find me on the ground, instead of this one. We waste time. We should complete our mission, and then we can talk. I agree. Oh, does that mean... Oh, I've got two followers. Ladies, let's do this. Girl power. Oh, here's a pirate. Oh, it's ecliptic. Let's see. Let's introduce ourselves properly again. We saw you guys earlier. Maybe a part or two ago. Good to see you again. Reintroduce you all to my stabs. There they are. Trying to get away from these stabs. Give you every piece of these. You too. Oh, you can't get away from this guy. No, sir. Where'd you go? You got away from this guy. Ah, oh, sneaky. Damn it. This is quite the lack of gravity in this area, sir. You hey. cannot beat me. Get back here. Stop running. Ah, damn rocks. Come on. Ah. The most acrobatic level five ever. There you go. Oh, well, yeah, it's something. Sure, we'll wear their pack for a little bit. Oh, is that a little critter? What is this critter? Well, if you're not bothering me. Oh, no, no. Ah, I see you too favor the stabs. Listen, sir. If you all would just cooperate, this would go a lot smoother. for you. Yeah, how do you like that? Alright, let's introduce ourselves again. You died today. Yes, they clearly haven't haven't seen my point. I 
Maybe this will get my point across. Ah, come on. Alright, who's left? Who's left? Hey, stop shooting at my friends. Oh, Nelly, there's a lot of them. Hey, you need to knock that off. Now back, back to you. Come on, finish him off, ladies. Ooh, space helmet. Sure, we'll put on their helmet. That kind of clashes with the outfit, but who cares? Ah, the target is in sight, ladies. Mission accomplished. But, stand back. Which one is this? Artifact Iota. Oh, somewhere in the middle now. Stand clear. Perfect. Let's take our prize. respond when I called to you after you pulled out the artifact. Does that mean Barrett's theory and experience were correct? The artifact grants the first person who touches it a vision? Yeah, I mean, it kind of looked like more of the device was built, but it still was pretty fuzzy. The fact that it has happened to both you and Barrett is already more than we had before. I think it is important that we discuss what you saw back there man what I had done oh I'm sure he deserved it yeah. yeah it was yes I appreciate that you see it that way a very practical outlook not one I find is shared amongst members of constellation may I ask what your background is oh hold on hold on now, we're a Jedi in hiding. How do I know you're not some Imperial spy? Yeah, I've done all sorts of things. Have you now? I have also seen a great many things in my time. Some quite dangerous. We both seem to be unusual additions to Constellation. Please, I would ask that you not mention to Vladimir the circumstances in which you found me. This is not the first time that Varun zealots have attempted to corner me. If it is known that this has happened again, well, it has been a while since I was given an assignment on my own. I would not want it to be even longer in the future. Do you understand? All right, sounds good. You know, you handle your own business, I'll handle mine. It is interesting that those zealots are after you? Yeah, tell me about that. Yes, it would seem they have not yet learned how much it will cost them. But then that is their fundamental problem, is it not? An inability to see anything other than the path which they have created for themselves. Oh, no. All right, you've got it. Mum's the word. Mum, this means we are in agreement. Thank you. That is good to know. I will finish here and return to New Atlantis when I can. You should go now, as they will be expecting us. Well, well, well. Is this the new competition, Sarah? Sarah? It seems you won. Congrats. Now, I may have to take you on a date on I Jemison. Will you back at the lodge. Yes, you will. And we'll have a date. And we'll see if we're compatible or not, you know? It's nice to have uh, two options, at least. Not have Sarah forced on me. All right. <clears throat> Enough of this banter. Let's head back to the lodge. I'm bunking on the ship. 
but nothing is better than unwinding in your own quarters. I couldn't agree more. Couldn't agree more. Last time you guys didn't I let me. You are satisfied with the quarters available Why? to you. Vasco, Was now's there a not the time. That I would not contribute to the mission? No, of course not. We thought you might be hurt. Oh, I then thank you, but was not necessary we succeeded yeah right you totally needed me there don't throw me under the bus here all right let's throw the two zeta and iota on okay look at you two i'm jealous i tried following up on some leads myself but came back empty-handed they could be anywhere can't they embedded in a rock or in the hands of an unsuspecting novelty goods trader? Um. Yeah, which leads are you were you following? A couple of scans from the eye, but it looks like you got there first. Shame on me for taking the scenic route, huh? Yeah, right. You just didn't want to get into trouble. I catch myself just staring at the collection sometimes, wondering what it all means. Maybe that's how our ancestors felt when they were looking up at the stars for the first time. They didn't just gawk at the stars, Mateo. They explored. They tested. Science brought us to space, not daydreaming. I disagree. What's the point of science if not to enable humanity's dreams? And where do those dreams come from? Not every dream is a pleasant one. I agree with Noel. The work is what moves us forward. You're with me, right? Science or dreams? Which one is the true muse of space exploration? Uh... Sure, dreams. Without them, science has no meaning. Exactly. We can't forget what really makes us human. Genes and evolution are what made us human, Mateo. Both of you clearly need to go back to school. Whoa! Dreams are I never went to school. But they don't pay for Helium-3. Constellation's bank account can attest to that. You know what? I just realized I completely overtook this whole conversation. This should be about you and Andresia celebrating a win for the group. Damn right. I do not mind being asked to join in a debate. It was good to hear everyone's sides. But I do agree that... We accomplished something together. Thank you for your help. <laughs> and for yours. I have no objections. Let us see what else we can find out there. Noel, pulling some interesting data from those new artifacts. Tell the Rook to meet me back on board the station. Roger that, Vladimir. He's on his way. Hmm, okay, so we have a new lead, and Sarah, you have been momentarily replaced. You know, Andresia, I believe that's how you say your name. We're going to test out the waters between us and see if we're compatible. And, you know, if opposites attract, then even better. But we will follow that lead that Vladimir has on the eye and uh, kind of go from there, but... What a victory. Two more artifacts. Wasn't expecting that. Each time we leave the lodge, we come back a wealthier man. And look at that. It's all coming together. So I'm not sure how many more we have. I see one spot there. Maybe a couple more. This thing's just going to be a perfect halo. Maybe Master Chief will arrive. Who knows? Until then, as always, thank you for joining. I'm CJ with MI Gaming with CJ Kenobi here at the Lodge, and we will see you on the next part.